You better repent. You're going to perish. Jesus. Yeah, I already said that. You need to turn to Jesus Christ. He's going to turn away from you. Now, you be a good boy and listen to your girlfriend. Be quiet. Listen to the preacher. You're going to hell without Jesus Christ. You need to repent. You need to obey the Bible. The Bible says that without holiness, no man will see the Lord. You guys don't even know what holiness is. You think holiness is something your mom who walks around with a funny turban on his head and a little dot on his forehead or whatever he is. I'm telling you, holiness is obedience to Jesus, obedience to the Bible, obedience to the Word of God, faith in Jesus Christ. Holiness is obedience to God. You don't obey God? You don't obey God, you're going to go to hell. That's not real. So you say, Junior, you won't say that on Judgment Day. You're going to weep, you're going to wail, you're going to wish you had a second chance today is the day of salvation, the day wherein you hear God's voice. Do not harden your heart. Don't harden your heart against Jesus, students. You old people, too, you need to repent, too. You ain't getting any younger, you know. You don't wear that helmet on the bike for nothing. You might slip, fall, and bump your head, and you'll be standing before God. What are you going to say? Hey, God, how you doing? Peace you out. Your time, you want to choke a bowl? No, I don't think so. Exactly. Going to hell without Jesus, students. Going to hell without Jesus. Hey, God made poison ivy, too. You don't smoke that, do you, Junior? No. God made crude oil. You don't drink that, but you drink your beer, do you? I didn't think so. Oh, it's a sad day in America, I tell you, sad, sad day. Reality is false, and false is reality. In the world of left-wing lunatic liberalism, reality is false, and false is reality. It has to be that way. Otherwise, the truth is true. Of course, False is reality, and reality is false in the left-wing liberal lunatic world of Berkeley, Berserkly, I should say. Because if you acknowledge truth, then your whole worldview comes crumbling down. That's right, righteousness, holiness, truth, the word of God. Where's that Bible? Thank you very much. My trusty Bible here. You gotta read the Bible, kids! Bible! Bible! Read the Bible! Holy Bible! Word of God, this is what's gonna judge you on the last day, kiddies. Yeah, kids, I should say. Children, little children, and older children. This is what's gonna judge you in the last day. The Word of God, the creator of all things, the living God. The God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, Yeshua, Jesus, the Son of God, lived, died, rose from the dead, frees you from sin, obey Jesus, or burn in hell. That's the gospel, students. Obey Jesus Christ, or you'll burn. Infierno eterna. Yes, burning forever, weeping, wailing, gnashing your teeth. Ah! Weeping, wailing, gnashing your teeth. Ah! Oh, it's a scary thing to fall into the hands of the living God. Fearful. Anybody fear God anymore? Oh, I thought God Berkeley says God doesn't exist. Well, I guess God just disappeared. I guess God just poked, disappeared. Yeah, I know. Sad. Jesus Christ is the ultimate firefighter. Right. To avoid the flames of hell, you need Jesus. You need Jesus, the Bible said. In the day wherein you hear God's voice, do not harden your heart. Don't harden your heart, students, against Jesus, against the preaching of the Word of God. Repent, obey. Repent, obey the gospel. Gospel is simple. God will.
receive you if you humble yourself and repent. Simple. You're so full of pride, so full of yourself, self-centered, self-seeking, self-absorbed, self-centered. Oh, stop it, little girl. Self-centered, self-absorbed, self-seeking. You love yourself so much, you're gonna love yourself to death. Oh, Jesus. Judgment days are coming, little girl. Uh, hell no, Jesus, yes! Speak English, little boy, speak English. Hell no, Jesus, yes! Repent, or you're going to perish, yes. Repent or perish, that's the Bible. Luke 13, verse 3, verse 5. The Bible says, unless you repent, you will perish. You better do more than put your hands together, youngster. You got to obey that Bible. Do what Grandma said. Do what Grandma said. You better be praying to Jesus. You be praying to Mohammed, that devil. What is this, the bomb squad? I don't know, it just, it just rolled up. Came it just rolled up? What do you mean it just rolled up? What is it? Does anybody know what that is? It just rolled up. It's a robot. It's a robot. It's a policeman. It's a police robot. What's it say on the back of it? And so Jesus, in his mercy and his love, sends the preachers out to warn you about hell, to warn you about judgment. What is that? That's my program. A what? What's in it? Oh, is it bringing you your food? Yeah. Why didn't you take your food? It's not hard. Oh, I see. Well, what is it? Food? Kiwi. Brings you the food. But he's too lazy to walk down to the pizza shop that you all read your kiwi. Isn't that cute? You gotta have the app to do that. You don't need an app to read the Bible. Cut picking Bible right here, man. The real deal. I know you're not into the Bible, girls. But let me share with you for a mere millisecond, as I have your attention. I need everybody to hear, that's why. When you're scared, you get loud! Yeah. I'm not afraid of you, but I'm afraid of God. The Bible says, fear God and keep his commandments. This is the whole duty of man, for God shall bring into judgment every work, with every single thing, whether it be good or evil. God's going to judge you, masturbating, fornicating, pill popping. Fear guzzling, party animals. You better repent. You're going to hell. You're going to hell without Jesus. Be no Kiwi deliveries in hell. You better repent, students. 